Former Luzerne County police officer who used and abused his authority to force women to perform sexual favors. That cop, former cop that is, appeared today in federal court to learn the penalty he must pay. The I-team's Andy Mahalshik was there for the sentencing and joins us live now in Ashley. Andy. Well, Mark, no doubt about it, high drama and lots of emotion inside that courtroom in Scranton today. Now, 31-year-old Mark Eicher was an Ashley Borough police officer when prosecutors say he would pull women over, usually late at night, and then intimidate them into performing sex acts in exchange for not arresting them. Well, today, a federal judge scolded Eicher, saying he violated the public trust and, again, violated the trust as a police officer. Then he sentenced him to 15 years in prison. Former Ashley police officer Mark Eicher, the man in the middle wearing the blue suit, walks into the federal courthouse in Scranton on Friday morning with his attorney and a family member. Mr. Eicher, do you want to say anything about before your sentencing to the women involved here? He pleaded guilty last November to abusing his authority as a police officer to obtain sexual favors from women while he was on duty in full uniform with the Ashley Police Department. He was first arrested in December of 2018 in connection with one victim. Then four other women came forward with similar stories of sexual abuse by him. Eicher said he was sorry at his sentencing. I apologize from the bottom of my heart to everyone in the case, especially the victims. I can't imagine what they went through. Judge Malachi Mannion had strong words for Eicher. This case disgusts me. You abused a position of trust you are supposed to protect the community to protect these women. Instead, you took advantage of them. Judge Mannion says he was so disgusted by Eicher's actions, he rejected the terms of a plea agreement made between prosecutors and defense lawyers that called for 12 years in prison. He increased the sentence to 15 years and ordered Eicher to register as a sex offender, saying that 12 years was not sufficient punishment for his crimes. Iker's attorney talked about why his client committed these crimes in the first place. Like I said, it was a breakdown of his family that then caused a, a mental lapse, and I think the court understood that by putting the mental health aspect in there. Mr. Iker, did you want to say anything to the, uh, I know you apologize in court, anything to the women? Now, two of his victims spoke out in court. In fact, one of his victims turned toward Iker sitting behind her, looked right at him, was crying, and said, you ruined my life, you changed my life forever. So we're going to hear from that woman and another woman coming up on Eyewitness News at 6. They spoke to us outside of court after that sentencing. Reporting live at Ashley Police Department in Luzerne County, Andy Mahalshik, Eyewitness News.